Hello and welcome to Sim.bc where my computer is slowly working itself up towards a 20 gig gigabytes of storage after being down at like 0 0.000 kilobytes <laughs> after me having to download all the having to download all the pictures and that was weird well that was probably just the air going in anyway so I've been downloading all my pictures and that set my storage unit down to like 0 0.00 kilobytes. So now I'm working myself up to a gig again or a couple of gigabytes, which is awesome. So I feel like I actually, that I actually have the time to, or the space and the ability to actually open up like a Word document. Yes, before I didn't. And what more are we celebrating today? Well, we're celebrating that I got breakfast. Yay! Always a good thing. And this is the best thing about frogs. I mean, look at this. Cost me like what, twelve crowns? What's that? Like one point two euros? Yeah, it's awesome. It's amazing in today's food industry where everything's so cheap. And I'm not, I would say expensive. I would first say expensive, but it isn't. It isn't is it? There are things you, like you can get really cheap food if you only know what to do, right? right? Anyway, but seriously, what are we celebrating? Well, I am celebrating that I am living alone. Yay! Must be the first time in like one and a half months that I've been alone and it's so amazing. I know that some people are like, oh I hate to be alone, I hate to be alone. Well, you people, I mean seriously, you've never been living with someone like this. I have 18 square meters to live on and my mate is taking up half of it just by being here. Seriously. That's if I include the toilet, like that's if I that if I include the toilet, they have like 18 square meters. So when he slept here and had his stuff here, he literally took up half of the space in my apartment. And I was like, dude, I love you, man. You can stay here, no worries. But seriously, I'm gonna kill you at one point. No, of course I'm not going to, but like, uh, I really, I really got frustrated, you know, with him. Uh, and the problem is that this guy, he's so nice absolutely one of the nicest guys I've ever met so uh, I want to uh, so I will look mental if I try to start an argument with him like for instance pick up the uh, like put down the toilet seat or pick up the uh, the toilet roll when you put in a new one or wipe the wipe the floor when you have gone out of the shower so that it's not wet so I don't get my socks wet when I stand there and take a piss all of that irritates me and like, and he leaves like the lights on and stuff. Uh, just so many small things that bugs me. But if I were to, to like uh, to confront him with this, I would look like a complete maniac because I would be all like, "Well, you don't switch up the lights. What you have to say in your defense?" And he's like, "You're a crazy person." And I'm like, "Yeah, I know." So I just waited for something big to happen so that I could actually be kind of angry with him, so that I could like exhale all of these smaller things but it never happened because this guy is so nice so every time we tell him like oh didn't do that don't do this and blah 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 whatever he's just like oh yeah no problem no i won't do it oh i will fix that oh you want me to do it now i'll go do it now so irritating people like that having no resistance <laughs> and i know that this is a very luxury problem and it's not something that i should be angry about or complain about but you know it's today's society i'm a millennia course I'm going to complain that's what I do that's what I'm best at anyway so going back to this idea that no what am I going to do with all my time well I actually don't know I'm so thrilled so excited that I can actually plan stuff again without having to rethink will I actually be able to do that or will I actually have the time for instance such an easy thing is recording this video I, I just thought like oh uh, so when I went to bed yesterday after helping him move I just thought, oh, tomorrow I want to take a shower, and I don't have to compete for the shower. Not that I had to before either, but like I still had to like say, I am going to take an, I'm going to take the shower now. Don't go in, like one of those things, which is not a competition, but it's still like something that I have to engage in. So now I don't have to care about that. And then I thought, oh, and then I want to eat breakfast directly after that. That means when I get out of the shower, I don't have to wait for someone to get ready. Because he's probably ready, he's waiting for me. And then I don't understand that, so I start waiting for him. And then he, I'm like, when are you done? He's like, oh, I've just been waiting for you. Which is completely understandable. That's a mistake that I think many people do. Uh, but yeah, communication, key. 
But now I can actually just take a shower, walk out, put on my clothes and go out. It takes like a minute, like in between the shower and going out. It's amazing. It's so, I, I can't explain it, but it's so, it's so freeing. Oh, sorry. And I know it's, it's uh, five past one and I haven't eaten breakfast yet. So that's where I'm at. I'm so excited that I haven't even done that, even though I went up at like 11.30, 12. Yeah, I know, that's not good, that's not good. I should start to go up earlier and try to go to the gym in the morning. Anyway, and when I went back home uh, from the uh, from the shopping, I realized I can record whenever I want to. I don't have to tell anyone, please move away so that, so that I can record. I just have to sit down put on the webcam and be like, hey, which is, uh, it's so freeing in relation to before. The only worry I have is that since I don't have to like plan so precisely when I have to, uh, ha when I have the time to record, I'm afraid that I will be all like, oh no, it's 12 o'clock, it's 11 a.m. No, it's 11 p.m. and I haven't recorded yet because I've been so relaxed the entire day. and being like, I can do it whenever I want to. So I'm probably going to to, to try and uh, get the time when I will try and sit down and do it. Well, it will probably be in the morning before the lecture and stuff, but well, we'll see how it all turns out. It's probably going to turn out great. And uh, yeah, and then the uh, final big thing to say is that I can finally clean. I'm such a cleaning maniac, really. I'm not obsessed. That's not what I'm saying. But as I've been saying, time. Time, time again. Structure is A and O in an organization. It's everything in between. Except for sustainability, but structure is sustainability, otherwise it won't work. Anyway, I'm very structured in my uh, in my everyday life. I like to have like a very minimalistic view of things and and uh, and the perspective where everything is like where it should be, you know, folded and stuff. Um, and well, when you have someone living in a in a briefcase, that's not possible at all because his clothes was all over the place he used half of my um, half of my table to have his stuff on and I'm a, tried to be a bit organized but he well he might not be um, or he, maybe he's very organized but in a very different way from mine from me from mine uh, whatever you say there this is going to be awesome so that's what I'm going to do today actually I'm going to try and be done with this video until like half past one which seems very reasonable right now and then I'm going to well, finish my sandwich and oh my big kid anyway <laughs> at the same front no they don't they have some probably have some weird name for it including many X's and Y's and Q's that are silent oh yeah and then I'm going to try and vacuum all my apartment and clean everything and they make the dishes and just wipe everything off and it's going to be such a satisfying experience and if I have time after that I'm going to engage in some competitive advantage for our company in enterprise and leadership yay which is like you know it's, yeah, it's not that interesting really and the funny thing with that is that I'm doing the competitive advantage which is like the shortest part or one of the shortest parts Unfortunately, I thought it was the longest one, so I was like, I'll take that, and the other people were like, phew, you took it, because it looks big on the summary. And then it turns out that the parts that they took were much bigger. So now I don't know how much they will have done until tomorrow, because I said like, Friday night is the deadline, so that we can look through it on Saturday, and so that we can rewrite it on Saturday, so that we can proofread it on Sunday, and then we can hand it in. And that's an actual we, because we had it in. I, I actually don't do that. But uh, anyway, so I'm going to try and explain to them. if, they, if So, th this is the thing. If they haven't done anything by tomorrow, one, I will try not to be pissed. Because, because this is all about the teamwork for my sake now. And I will try to explain to them that I really don't get a grade from this. I'm just trying to do everything correctly to be nice to you. I could skip everything if I wanted to have no you know great incentive to actually do this what I have an incentive is, is that I want to actually learn I don't know if you can hear this it sounds like a helicopter quite cool actually anyway but uh, yeah it's flew oh there it is 
Oh, nice. Oh, well, anyway, don't, don't, don't know if you hear, heard that. Otherwise, I'll just look like a, well, a maniac. <laughs> yeah. But anyway, if they haven't done anything by tomorrow, I'm going to try and focus on the group aspects and be all like, no worries, mate, we'll try and work this out. I have no incentive to actually do some a great work here, more than I want to learn and do everything. You know, you know, be included and invested in every part. That's why I'm doing it. That's why I'm looking like a team leader, maybe. Or because I have such a strong personality that likes to take everything, everyone and everything into account and structure things. Might be that too. So we'll see how it all works out. We'll see if they post things. They might not do. But this is Friday. And if I say Friday night, that can be everything in between Thursday night and Saturday night. Because deadlines here aren't as big of a thing. Woo you know, with the good and the bad. Anyway, so that's all I had to do say today. No, I have like a thousand things to say, but that's all I'm going to say today. And we'll and I we <laughs> no. I will see you guys tomorrow. So have a nice day guys and I will try to clean my apartment and eat me breakfast. Have a nice day. Bye.